we're going to be playing American Mahjong at Mahjong time using National Mahjong League rules. If you don't know how to play yet, look for the link to a brand new lesson playlist for American Mahjong. There are going to be four playlists, Fundamentals, Skill Builders, Strategy, and Variations. It really is a great version of Mahjong. Very clever, very creative, and quite different than most other versions. Well worth the effort to learn. If you stick around the live stream that's going to kick off here in a minute, you'll get to see how the game is played. At Mahjong time, it's very realistic, and that's one of the reasons why I enjoy playing here so much, that and the community and the support team as well. I'm going to turn on the live stream now. I hope you enjoy the session. Welcome to the live stream. We're going to be playing American style Mahjong at Mahjong time using National Mahjong League rules. I forgot to log in. Let me log in. And I have a lozenge in my mouth because I have a cold. <clears throat> Excuse me. So if I cough and sniffle, forgive me. So we will log in here and see if we can find a table and play some Mahjong. I would like to focus on playing the addition category because I avoid it. I think because it feels random. Those numbers just feel random to me. But I was thinking about it and really the addition category is still somewhat flexible if you don't Kong those flowers actually. Once you Kong those flowers, you're a bit stuck. But the first addition hand, you can play 369, potentially. For the next one down, 84, that one is a little tricky. I don't think there's much recourse there because you can't really switch to 2468. But for 579, the last one, the 7 and the 5, you could potentially switch to an odd hand. So there is a little bit of wiggle room, but not a lot, which is probably one reason why I tend to avoid that category. Hi, Chris. Welcome to the live stream. Welcome, everybody. Say hi in chat. To chat, you're going to look for the word top chat or live chat in the bottom right corner of your screen. If you click live chat, that's what you want. And I really am not sure about the difference, but click live chat. So say hi. Hi, Marsha. Hi, Maureen. Welcome, Judy. Oh, let's see if there are any tables. Whoa, look at that. Oh, we got lots of players. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I haven't played much lately. So I was going to notice the names of the tables. I've been so focused on taping or videoing, filming. Can you tell my brain is kind of muddled? I've been refilming all my lessons for American Mahjong. And I've also been filming in advance the videos for November because I'm going on a trip. I'm going on a trip to South Carolina this weekend. I'm so excited. I get to see my friend Peggy in real life. So I hope to meet more. Oh, there she is. She's in the live stream. <laughs> so I'm so excited. I just love meeting any Mahjong player actually around this country. I mean, there are many Mahjong players and I love to meet everybody. Okay, I have someone saying hi in chat. Okay, let's see if we can get somebody to play. You don't see a table? Oh, okay, let me see. There we go. Wait a minute. There it is. Thank you for telling me that. 
because I had the wrong option selected in my OBS. That is my control panel. I did not have the right option selected. Okay. So we're waiting for a player. And I hope people don't avoid a table because of me. Because you know what? I'm a player just like you. I win some and I lose some. We just lost another player. Some people are afraid to play with me. But you know what? I'm just like you. My luck comes and goes. And there is luck in the game. I do think there is more skill though for more advanced players. The more, the more advanced you are on that spectrum from beginner to advanced, I think the less skill is, or the less luck is involved and the more skill, but there's still luck in there. So, you know, if I don't get my tiles, it's kind of hard to win if you don't get your tiles at the right time. Okay. So we got another player. We need, we need another player. <clears throat> Uh, let's see. You have trouble because you can hear me talking and, and the table lady. Oh, you can turn your computer, you turn your, um, your audio off on your computer or mute it. Okay, here we go. We're going to play. We have no flowers, so I'm not going to play an addition hand. It's a little hard to play addition with no flowers. So I am seeing here. One, two, three, four, two, three, four, five. We have no sixes and eights. Otherwise I would consider evens, but because there's a gap, both with the six and in the eight, I'm not going to play that. Let's keep the one though. Maybe we could use a one, but that means passing like numbers. And I refuse to do that. So I'm going to pass the one. Here we go. <clears throat> Oh, Chris, I know. I'm so excited about Destin. Look what I got. Is that it? A map. I've been studying it. I'm so excited. Oh, look, we got a six. And we paired up a four. Okay, so here we have a, a two, four, four, nine. Let's get rid of the nine. And let's get rid of, let me see here. This is getting a little awkward here. Three, four, three. Let's see. Let's get rid of the, oh, let's get rid of the five and the, and the two. One, one, two, three, four, maybe. I am going to visit Peggy and her friends in South Carolina, Solomon's Island this weekend. And then in December, the week of Christmas, I'm going to Destin, Florida. And that's where Chris is with all her friends. <clears throat> okay, so we have a West. We do have a lot of two, three, one, two, three, four. I'm still wondering if the eight BAM might come in because we're really set up nicely for that two, four, six, eight pair hand. If we can get the eight BAM, let's see if we can make it work. I'm kind of forcing it at the moment, but we just still do have some consecutive run flexibility here. All right, we got a red, a six and a three. We paired up the three, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Oh, look at all these fours here. Oh, I would come to Michigan. I like cold weather. I lived in Colorado for 20 years. The cold doesn't scare me. Oh no, no, not at all. I rarely wear a jacket in the winter. I mean, in the South, it's not bad anyway, but uh, let's see here. We need to pick something here. Two, three, four. Oh, let's, let's pass the one BAM, I guess. I'm still hoping for an eight BAM. If we can get that eight BAM, we might be able to, oh, look it, we got it. Oh, okay. Now all we really need here is a flower. Okay. So let's pass the three, two, four, six, eight pair hand. We got a gap though. No flowers. 
we're going to get rid of this three right here. Two, four, six, eight pair hand. Second one down. Oh. Okay. We're going to pass. Maybe we could go ahead and pass three, six right here. There we go. Oh, thank you, Marsha. Thank you, thank you. Okay, we need a flower. Most people do not pass flowers in the Charleston. Very risky for this reason. No flower. Let's get rid of this nine. Uh, we'll take three. I would love to pair up the four, six, eight there. Oh, no tiles. Okay, Plett doesn't want any tiles. That's not a good sign. We need a flower, and then we need to pair up the four, six, eight. But we are four away from a pair hand, which is pretty nice. I think I could hold this green dragon, though. We might be able to play the concealed hand and use the fours as joker bait if it doesn't come in. Okay, so here we go. Phase two, pick and discard. There's a two. That's not what we need, though. We need to pair up the four, six, eight. But I'll hold it anyway. Leave my options open. We could switch to that concealed hand. If we draw some jokers, we can switch. Two characters. There was a hesitation with this two. I'm wondering if someone might need the two crack, but they weren't ready for it. We'll see. I'm kind of forcing a pair hand right now. Five oh, a two dot. Let's get rid of the two crack. Two characters. Oh, nobody wanted it. I was talking about the addition category when I first logged on. You might have missed it. But I tend to avoid that category because it just does not feel very flexible to me. Oh my goodness, look at what we got. We got a three, two, three, four, and all these fours. Oh my gosh. Okay. No flowers. Two, three, four with fours. Wow, this is this is not going well. Two dot. Hmm. Oh no. All right, well, anyway, I was talking about addition. I just don't think that category is flexible at all. Once you have a Kong of four flowers, you're stuck. There's only one other hand that uses four, no, two. Oh, I'm going to get rid of the five. <clears throat> There's um, the year, or not the year, but the Winds and Dragons category uses four flowers. Two hands, one north, south, one east, west. There's one hand in the year category that uses four flowers. And then you have addition. We're not going to take that. Oh my goodness. This is insanity. Okay, we're going to give up on the pair hand. So we have two, three, four. Oh, shoot. This is a mucky mess right now. AKA hot mess in today's lingo. There's that dang two. I think I drew every single one of those. All right. Well, anyway, that addition category, I just tend to avoid it. I think there, there is a little bit of flexibility with addition. The very first one with the three, nine, you could maybe switch to something in three, six, nine. If you don't have a Kong of flowers, Okay, we got a two. <clears throat> wow. And then the five, seven, if you don't have that Kong of Flowers, you could maybe switch to five, seven, nine, big odds. But the four, eight, you're stuck. And the minute you have those flowers Konged, you're stuck. So when you play that, you better have your one, two ready. 
Otherwise, you could be painted, painting yourself into a corner with that category. I just tend to avoid it, I think, because of that reason. Are there any categories that you avoid? Write it in the comment section. I would be curious to know. We've got Joker bait with fours here. And oh, wow, that was relatively quick. One, three, five with dra uh, dragons. Very nice. Okay, well, let's play again. I want to look at the tables, though. I haven't been on in a while because I've been so focused. You have, okay, Maureen says she avoids concealed hands. And Judy says that she avoids evens. The thing about uh, evens is you can really easily switch to consecutive run if you fill in gaps, like two, four. If you get threes, you can go to consecutive run with two, three, four. So I think evens is fairly flexible if, if your hand doesn't come in. Um, and then as far as concealed, I can see why someone might avoid that category, but I say if the tiles are there for a concealed hand, play it through. Okay, so let's see here. We have a lot of fast players, thanks, fast players. Look at all this fast players, thanks. I don't know about that. Uh, let's see. And then we have auto pass, six second auto. I thought that there were no more six second games. There are no more six second games, actually. It might be in the title, but it's not the table speed. The decision timing that you have at the table to, to make decisions is seven and eight seconds right now. And you can create a table with up to 10 seconds to decide. And that's a relatively new uh, change to Mahjong time for American Mahjong. Why did they stop the six second choice? Because uh, um, the community was expressing a, a disinterest because it's too fast. So they decided to nix the six second option and go with seven to 10 as the option for decision making to try to open the doors and be a little more comfortable for beginner intermediate players or just people who like to take a little more time with their decision making. So for this particular set of tiles, I'm thinking 369. We do have some 135 potential. There's one hand uh, that uses 13579 in mixed suits. It's the second one from the bottom. We do have no gaps for that but it is very specific and I'd have to pick that hand right now. Although we did just now get a multiple for it. So we have two multiples. We just need to pair up the one, three, five. Let's go ahead and see what happens. We do have uh, some potential for the, let's see here. Oh, I was thinking a mixed suit five, seven, nine hand, but that's not on there. That's last year's card. Oh my gosh. That was a blast from the past. I don't know why I thought that was valid. So let's see what happens with this one, three, five, seven, nine, second hand from the bottom. We already picked our hand. We just need to pair up the one, three, five, and, and we can get a little more comfortable with this particular hand. And no keepers here, but we do have tiles to pass, thankfully. Let's see, G uh, Judy says the fast player thanks is just a way of asking the players to play relatively quickly. Oh, okay, I see. The six second though, don't worry about that six because really it's seven. If you look in the next column over, the time limit is seven seconds, not six. So they're just asking players to make quick decisions apparently. I stand uh, corrected, Judy. Thank you. Okay, we have tiles to pass. Oh, I really don't like passing two wins together like this because of news. If you pass two wins together, it's almost like passing a pair. It's like a step down from passing a pair. If someone's playing news, you could feed it right into their hand. But 
we have no gaps and all we need to do is pair up one tile to get set so I'm gonna go ahead and move these along hello there Hi. how are you my son just got home creeping up the stairs okay here we go we're passing two winds hold your breath okay let's see alieska says that she doesn't avoid any of the hands after watching the videos <laughs> oh that's awesome i'm glad they've helped oh the charleston part of the game actually that the you mean the seven seconds is that right i thought you have the seven or eight seconds even during the pick and discard phase of the game you have seven well whatever number is on the table like for this table let's see here game game ooh, ooh. table info settings for this table it's an eight second table it's called move time so you have eight seconds to make a decision during the charleston and during the pick and discard phase of the game we still do not have a one three five crack that is what we need badly right now one three five in cracks one any one of them will do is that asking too much i don't think so if we get a one three five crack we'll be set because we can kong the seven and the nine again this is it the second from the bottom someone's passing blind oh i saw a crack come in it's not right okay let's see if we can get three out of um this player sitting across from me they only wanted two tiles they want two we'll give them a north and a three i don't want to pass a north and an eight because there is a year hand that uses wins and eights of course let's see marcia says people want you to make decisions in less than eight seconds and you say poo poo to you he he poo poo oh we got a joker oh i wish i could play a quint look at all those jokers oh my goodness okay what could we you know what maybe we could switch to seven eight nine consecutive run we need an if we get an eight crack we could switch to the consecutive run mix suit kong hand we'll get rid of the south if we get that eight crack we could switch to the consecutive run kong hand but the one three five hand that hand is a higher point hand by five five points but you know it adds up we got the eight look at that <laughs> we're set okay i think we should go ahead and play seven eight nine consecutive run and get rid of these singles and we have a flower so we're ready to kong the hand is set we'll get rid of that unless i draw a one three five i might go back we'll see we'll see none are out there's no one three five out but we would be two away we would still need to discard that flower and pair up okay there's a nine don't need it i think we should go ahead and do the consecutive run kong hand nobody wanted wins oh there's the five there's five crack oh another joker oh my goodness look at that oh i wish i could play a quint oh my goodness it just seems like such a waste there's no way to switch to a quint right now though seriously i mean yeah I, I don't think it's possible to switch to a quint. The tiles are not right. Now, I'm tempted, but I can't. I'm not going to do it. Let's see if we can get a win for this itty bitty hand. Any win is a good win. Oh, look what we got a seven. Maybe we can self pick. We need a flower though. They're very hard to get, I think. 
because there are double pungs on this card, flowers are hard to get. Hmm. Uh, let's see here. Peg, thank you for staying strong against a quint. I can't breathe. Can't breathe. I can breathe. Oh, <laughs> was I making you cringe thinking about switching to a quint? This would not work. I mean, we have mixed suits. You know what? If, if this were a one suit Kong Han, I'd do it. But we have mixed suits. There's no way to switch to a quint here. I keep thinking about it though. Nope. Let's see. Three dots. Yeah, there's three six dots out. Let's get rid of that dragon. We need to have at least one Kong so we can claim a, a flower. The flowers are probably going to start going down here pretty soon. We're not ready for it. We'll get rid of the four. There are no seven dots out. I want to get rid of that pretty quick, though. It's a fresh tile. We're not even in the middle game yet, though. Let's see. Wait. I guess we are. Oh, we got the flower. Okay, nice. Now I can rest easy. We're ready. Seven. Ready on a seven bam, eight crack, or nine dot. Any one of those will give us a win. Five dot. Oh, no jokers. Three and none of our tiles are out. I wouldn't mind picking this win. I have VIP coupon codes. If anybody wants to try Mahjong Time 30 day VIP codes, I got a new batch. So I'm ready to dole them out if you want to come and play. My email's in the video description. Where are these tiles? Mm. Two bamboo. These are fresh tiles. There it is, Mahjong. Mahjong. Woohoo! Let's see what everybody was playing here. I wonder how tight this got. Let's take a peek. We have, what do we have here? Oh, I don't know what they were doing here. One, three, seven, red, six, eight. Oh, they were trying to play six, seven, eight, knitted consecutive run, and they had joker bait with the one and the three, so they were quite a ways away. And then here we have, uh, maybe they were trying for a year hand. And then here we have four or five dragons, but the white dragons were over in the other player's hand. Okay. We got a win. It's always, oh, very nice. Someone congratulated me. Okay, so we got a win. It's always nice to win once when you play in a session, don't you think? Oh, here we go. We're going right into a game. All right. I hope I get all those jokers back and play. We could play a quint. Let's see. Not a joker in sight, not one joker in sight, but we do have a pair of flowers and look at this consecutive run here. Wow. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Hmm. Okay. Oh man. Let's see here. We do have some three, six, nine consecutive run. Let's give up the four bam the south and the one 
I'm just wondering if winds, I want to see if winds are going to come around. I just feel it. Winds really came around before. There's a wind. So we have a seven, a one. Let's get rid of the two. Let's see if winds come around. Okay. I want to see if winds come. I do like wind's hands. I think they're pretty. No winds. Oh my goodness, we got like numbers. Look at that. Threes. What about if we play a one, three, five category? Look at this. Okay. Look at all those threes there. I pulled over the east. I don't think we should keep the winds. Okay, let's see. We do have a pair hand potential. And maybe, let's see. Let's get rid of, oh, one, three, five. Okay, let's get rid of the three crack. Because we do have one, three, five, seven, nine. Uh, no gaps with one, three, five, seven, nine. We just have to wait it out and see. So now we have a white dragon. Let's get rid of the east and the three. So we have one, three, five, or big odds, five, seven, nine. Let's focus on odds and get rid of the three, four, east. Addition, addition, seven, five, 12. Nine, three, yeah, I suppose we might be able to do an addition hand. I just, uh-oh, who stopped it? Okay, Pet Van Gogh. We can, we can pass. Let's just pass. No, let's pass three. We'll see. We still can play the addition category, but we only have two flowers. Three, six, nine, west. Three, six, nine, west. Uh, three, oh, the dra white dragons. Three, six, nine, white dragons. Three, oh, I gave up the six. I give I, I gave up the six already. Um, let's see. We do have some five. So let's get rid of the wins. So we do have some big odd potential here, but we have all singles except for a pair of flowers. That is the only redeeming quality at the moment for this hand. Look at that. We are an underdog for this one. Oh, there's a multiple. Nine. Five, seven, nine matching dragon concealed. The concealed hand under odds. Pair of flowers, pungs of five, sevens, nines, and the matching dragon. Maybe we could get rid of this two because there is that pair hand for odds. Two flowers, one, three, five, and one suit, and five, seven, nine in a second suit. We'd have to throw away a nine, a pair of nine dots, though. At this point, I'm kind of thinking that the concealed big odds hand is probably the best choice. Uh-oh, soap, shoot, soap. What about the soap? Okay, we are inching along here. One, three, five dots, five, seven, nine crack. That's kind of what I was thinking, but we'd have to throw away a pair of nine dots. I really want to leverage those nine dots. So I'm thinking the big odds concealed hand, the last one under, under the odds category. We just paired up. We paired up a one. Whoa. 
let's see, 135579. Mm. All right, we'll see. We'll see if we can pair up the 579 here. We just paired up there another one. Okay, we're going to give up on the pair hand because we now have 579. Yep, decision time. I gave up on the singles, the single cracks. You can use those nines in many hands. Addition, big odds. Yep, I agree. It's Oh, and we just got a nine. <laughs> oh, darn it. Doesn't that happen, though? You make a decision, and then they the tiles start coming in for whatever you <laughs> decided against. Oh, my goodness. I hate that. Okay, so we're in between the one suit one three five seven nine full range odd hand or five seven nine with dragons concealed let's see how this goes we're really light with the five that's my only concern right now we're very light with the five and a white dragon is out right now I'm getting rid of that six. Maybe they're playing like numbers. No, I guess not. So I'm thinking five, seven, nine dragon. Use the ones as joker bait. Or we could play one through one, three, five, seven, nine odds and use the flower. Oh, it's decision time. I'm going to pass. We can, we can take the next one if it comes. Just because it goes down doesn't mean you have to take it. We could always use jokers. I do not like to commit. We are really, really light in the three and the five. Uh-oh. Let's pung it. Okay, we're going to go for the big odds, or not the big odds. We're going to go ahead and play the one suit hand um, because I would need a joker for that, that seven. All right, this is getting, this is going to be tight here. We need a three dot. Okay, six, eight. Two, four, six, eight, they're playing. Mixed suits. Let's see, they have a six, eight out. Six, eight. So they need a two, four Some in, in a suit. I'm not sure which yet. Let's see, two, four. There's a two dot and a two bam out. Oh, we got the five. Nice. Okay, we need, we need a nine dot and a... Oh, we can, oh, the convention is pair. Do I have the right card here? Yes. Okay, we need a pair, pair, pung, pung, kong. Pair, pair, pung, pung, kong. We need a three dot and a nine dot. Or an eight dot so we can get a joker. Let's see, I'm trying to figure out, uh, let's see. To pass on the first opportunity. Oh, look what we got, nine dot, very nice. I pass on the first opportunity to Pung when you have another chance to get the tile so you don't commit too early. Yes, I do not like committing early. We're going to Kong it. And down goes first flower. Let's see if someone takes it with a joker. Nope. I need to get rid of this flower. Yes, agreed, Judy. It is hard, and I really hesitated on that. I, I was still hoping to do a concealed hand. Oh, they wanted BAMs. Okay, very nice. Okay, let's see here. We were one away. Bummer. Okay, uh, we were looking at here. It looks like they were vacillating between consecutive run and two, four, six, eight of some kind for this player. And over here we have a three, six, nine. 
they had Joker bait and three discards. So yeah, this uh, player who won, they, they really kind of had an open road there. Okay, here we go. We're going to play some more. Oh, Joker. Jokers are nice. We have, oh, we've got another one. Okay, let's see here. We have north and south and a pair of sixes here. Maybe we could play a quint. Let's see if we can get some wins. We could maybe play three, six, nine though. Three, six, three, six, nine. Let's pass these three and see what happens. Okay. We got a wind. East. Okay, now we got a five and a three. I'm kind of thinking we could maybe play a quint. So I think I'm going to keep the six. Let's see if wins come in. If nothing else, the sixes could be joker bait. Okay, no keepers. Let's do those three. Okay, I would love to get some more wins, or at least maybe the south for that quint. I would love to play a quint. I think quints are my favorite. If I had to pick a favorite, I would say quints. I do like like numbers, though, too. Okay, look here. We got an east. Let's keep it, and we have tiles we can pass, one of each suit. If everybody wants to keep a going. Okay, here we go. So I'm thinking either a quint, south, green, six dot, or a news hand, Kongs, maybe concealed if we can get flowers. We'll see. I like having a waypoint, but I believe in staying flexible too. We got a six. That's not really helpful though. I was thinking maybe we could do east and west with sixes. Let's pass these three and see what happens. We got wins and a pair. Look what we got. Oh my gosh. I think we should say goodbye to the, to the Quint. Look at all those wins. We could play East and West with greens. No, cause I'm not passing like numbers. Let's, uh, let's see news. Let's pass the green. We're going, we're going right. Last right. Okay, let's keep the six for Joker bait. We're going to play news because we got a pair. Somebody gave us a pair. Very generous, I must say. Oh, Debbie, thank you for the super chat. Oh, I'm so glad the videos have helped you. Okay, they want two, two tiles. I will gladly give two tiles. So I think we do not have to choose yet, but really we have two choices. We could play the news Kong hand, third one down or concealed if we get a flower. And I wouldn't mind playing concealed for the extra points. 
Oh, we got Joker bait. Okay, here we go. One bam. One bamboo. East and west. No. Okay. So the south went down. That would have been for maybe a concealed hand. For the news Kong hand, the south is a pair. Seven characters. Seven characters. If I didn't have jokers, I would play the news uh, pair hand, I think. Okay, now that, let's Kong. Kong. Let's go ahead and play the Kong hand. Yep, Judy, I think a lot of people think that dragons are not well used this year. I kind of agree. I, I like dragon hands, and I think the wind and dragon cat category is a bit light uh, as far as dragons go. We got an east. All we need is a north to get set. There are only three hands in the wind and dragon category with, with dragons. That seems light to me. Oh, you like the Kong hand? The news Kong hand? Me too. It's a pretty hand. Seven we do have Joker bait with these three cracks. I wouldn't mind drawing this west. Oh, look what we got. We got the north. That's kind of nice. Okay, we're set. We just need the east and the north. I wouldn't mind drawing that west, though, because they still don't know what we're playing. There are some east and west hands. There's two east-west hands. Okay, we're good there. East and west with greens, east and west with evens, or the news Kong hand. It could be any one of those three hands, but if anybody draws that east, they're going to... Have a hot potato. Did you guys ever play that ge that game when you were little? Hot potato. Uh, let's see. Judy says there are only seven hands that have a Kong of dragons. Yeah, that's um, pretty light. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, one six, seven. You're right. I concur. I'm going to get ready to take this west. Oh, green. I really thought I was going to pick a west. We need a keeper. Oh, we got a keeper. Okay. We need either a north or an east to win. Oh, oh, that red dragon Kong. It's a little scary. Twenty-two hands that use nines. Oh my goodness. That's significant. That is very interesting. Nines. 22. That's almost half the hands. That's interesting. 
Hmm. I'm going to have to think about that. Oh, we need a north or an east. I'm on the edge of my seat. It's just a little 25 point hand, but it's a winner. It could be. I think anybody might be scared of throwing a wind though. There it is. Got it. Nobody had the east. They were in the wall. Oh, goodness. Now that is a pretty hand, don't you think? It pleases my OCD. Okay. Let's go again. Thank you, Judy. Yeah, two, two wins down. That feels very nice, I must say. I've been working really hard on videos, and so I haven't played much at all. It feels kind of good. And all the videos I've been doing have been on a mock card that I made up. And so when I look at this card, I feel like I'm, I'm having to learn a brand new card because I've been so focused on those other videos. And so I'm feeling a little rusty. I wonder if that's how people play, uh, feel when they play like um, the next generation, excuse me, the next generation card or, or maybe uh, American Mahjong Association card or Marvelous Mahjong. Do any of you guys play those? Okay, here we go. We have a pair of sevens, no flowers, one wind. I wonder if we could do, let's see, five through eight consecutive run or one, three, five, five, seven, nine. We have no jokers, so a pair hand might work. So let's see, one, three, three. Let's give up the east. Here we go. Okay, so I'm thinking either odds or consecutive run. We need some decisions in here. Okay, three, four, five. We do have three, four, five, six, seven potential. Let's give up the three here. There is this kind of awkward consecutive run hand, um, the fourth hand down pairs in a sequence of three and then two Kongs shift it up. One, two, three, four, five. We could do two, three, or three, four, five, six, seven, for example. Let's see, we just gave up that three. And there's a seven. Let's see. So we have a seven, a six, three. Let's see. Let's give up the red and the eight. I think we could still have options open for odds. This would be the second from the bottom odd hand, a odd pair hand, the consecutive run fourth hand down or something consecutive. We just got a seven and a nine. Okay, we definitely don't need the one. We definitely do not need the nine. So by process of elimination, we need one more tile to pass. We have six, seven, seven. We have all the sevens. Let's give up the six. No, we need that six. Let's give up the eight. Because if we play, if we get a five crack, we could play three, four, five pairs, Kong of six, bam, Kong of seven dot. Okay, now we just got a six dot and like numbers. We did pair up the one though. One. Okay, let's give up on the consecutive run hand and focus on odds or we could switch to like numbers with odds or we could do six seven okay we got a six and an eight 
Okay, now six, here's an eight. Let's give up the three, the six. Okay, so we have six, seven, eight, six, seven, six, seven. Let's give up the eight. We could still play like numbers with sevens. Or we could play big odds or an odd pair hand. We've got gaps though. Okay, I just got a little text from Slava. He played in an American Mahjong tournament. I'm going to ask him how he did. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, how did it go? Oh my goodness, I have a cold. Excuse me. <coughs> okay, what do we get? We got a 9 and a 1 and a 3. So let's see here. How many tiles do we want to pass? One, three, five, seven, nine. We can give up the nine, bam. We really don't need that. Let's give up the one, three, nine. That's a little risky though. Odds end three, six, nine in one pass. Uh, oh, I really wish that were a nine dot not a nine crack we got a one and a four those are all discards we can get rid of all those this is a hot mess again no no oh joker okay so we're not playing a pair hand no more pair hand okay so we need to recover now so i'm thinking Five, six, seven, four, five, six, seven, five, seven, nine. We can use the ones as joker bait. Let's just hold these ones for joker bait. Oh, we got the we got the nine, and I just discarded that three. But you know what? I don't want to play a pair hand. We'd have to throw away a joker. Let's get rid of the four. Next, so we could do either big odds or five, six, seven. Nope. Okay, we got a five. I'm thinking maybe big odds at this point. Probably the sixes can go next. Ooh. Okay, let's get rid of the six and focus on big odds. So we're going to get rid of the six next. I'm thinking maybe if I had to pick a hand, probably the second hand down, big odds, five, seven in pungs, in the bams, and then seven, nine in dots. I don't know. I wouldn't pick a hand, not yet. I mean, we could still switch to, we still could switch to like numbers with sevens. We did get that dragon. If we could get flowers, we're going to have to make a choice here in a few minutes. Let's see. Let's get rid of that. Definitely 579, Judy. Judy. One, three, five, bam, five, seven, nine, pair with gaps. Oof. We drew jokers. Okay, I am not going to take that. I do not take, make an exposure just because I can. We, we don't even know what hand we're playing right now. If I played the one, three, five pair hand, we would have to, oh, look, we got a, we got a multiple there. Let's get rid of the dragon. We could play five, seven in dots, seven, nine in cracks. Okay. One, three, five, five, seven, nine. We'd have to throw, oh, we got a flower. Okay, let's get rid of the one. We need to leverage those jokers. Five, seven, seven, nine. Keep the seven. The five and the one can go. Oh, now we have a nine bam. Oh, this is getting crazy. Three 
Okay. Seven, nine. This feels like the first hand we played with the eight. Because we have mixed suits. If we get an eight ban, we could play seven, eight, nine mixed suit Kongs. Oh, okay, Chris. Okay. Oh, we're not taking that. If nothing else, we need the five dot. Okay, let's get rid of that not the nine bam. Okay, there's a nine dot now. Five seven seven nine. We've got a flower. I'm thinking the five seven nine one suit. Let me see with five seven nine with one suit. Kongs. We could use the nines as joker bait maybe. I don't know though. This um, wind hand is creeping up. Seven characters. No, no, no. Oh, and look, seven bam. Okay, maximum usage. Five, seven, nine, I think is going to use the most of our tiles. We can't use all the multiples here. I think this eight is going to have to go. The five can go for sure. Oh, look, there's a nine. Okay, I think that kind of solidifies it there. Five, seven, nine, Kong hand. One suit. Third hand down on the right. We have Joker bait with the nine crack. So let's see what's out. A seven dot is out. We're going to need a joker there. And then we need five dots. Oh, all those five, seven, nines. Oh. No. At least it's a safe tile, most likely. Oh my goodness, look what we got. We just got a pung of nine cracks. Maybe we should switch to like numbers with nines and flowers at this point. We totally could do that. If we get a flower, we could play like numbers with nines and flowers. The flower will be the killer. Always have to wait for a flower. But you know what, if we switch to like numbers with nines, I'm going to Kong it. We're switching to like numbers with nines because we have no five. And also one of those jokers would have to be used for the seven dot. This way we don't have to use any jokers for those nines and we can use the jokers for flowers. Oh, and then we get the five. Can you believe that? That's the second time that happened to me. Oh my goodness. Oh, 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 that's like salt in the wound. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I just, that's what I was waiting for, that stinking five. Okay, we're going to pung it. All right, now I need to declare this. I need to define this as a flower. Uh oh. They didn't mahjong. We're going to Kong it. Let's see if someone takes that seven dot. Darn it. Oh, shoot. Okay. We are half naked right now. Everybody knows what we need. We need a flower very badly. These are safe. Nobody wants a seven. Five more picks. We have one discard. Lots of jokers out. Lots of jokers are out. Uh-oh. 
Okay, probably 2468 BAMs and cracks. Second hand from the bottom. Lots of jokers are out right now. They are up for grabs. Oh, shoot. At least that was a safe tile. We are kind of stuck. Oh, flower went down. But that's the only one. Okay, here we go. A pick is coming. Oh, we got it. Okay, we're ready. Let's hope because those flowers were down, maybe they're thinking I'm not ready. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Uh oh. Oh no! We need a keeper. Oh shoot! Oh my goodness. Everyone was throwing flowers. Maybe they'll throw a flower. Oh, we have another chance. Oh, they got it. Oh, darn it. Oh, we were ready to win. Shoot. All right. Well, that's nice. Okay. Kudos. All right. News Kong hand. And then over here, East had news with Kongs of dragons. They couldn't get jokers. And then here we have uh, two, four, six, eight, and they were ready to win on a two bam or a six crack. Wait a minute. Yeah, I guess so. Okay. Oh, I didn't get in. I wonder what happened. Oh, <laughs> Gwen, the person who won, she said she learned from me. Oh, that's nice. I like that. Okay, here we go. I would like to play something big. Let's see if we can get some jokers. Maybe we can force a quint and not a single joker. Okay, maybe we can force pair hand then. Let's see. All right, we have no multiples at all, all singles. This is, uh, yeah, very, very spread thin. Spread super thin. All right, so let's see. One, two, three, four. That's going to be the most flexible. One, two, three, four, consecutive run. So let's pass these three then. I don't know though. You know what? Let's, um, let's keep the wins because maybe they'll come and we could play the news pair hand. Let's go ahead and give up the, the one bam. Although the one is kind of flexible. You could play a year hand too. Here we go. Four, six, seven. That's not bad. All right. So let's see what we can do here. We could maybe play a year hand or something consecutive. We're just waiting for tiles. There we go. Okay. The ones came in. Two of them, as a matter of fact and year tiles. So we have year potential here. So let's go ahead and keep the east and give up the green six, four, three. Let's break up. Oh, no, no. Oh, I'm not going to pass like numbers. No way. Okay, here we go. I'm thinking either a year hand or a year hand. I suppose if we get a two bam, we could do consecutive one, two, one, two concealed pungs. We could always do like numbers with ones. Oh, I should have probably kept that green dragon. Oh, well, too late now. When you play live, you can change your mind if you didn't look at your, your incoming pass, but 
online. Once you pass tiles, you're done. Can't pull them back. Okay, we got a one and a two. A one and a two. One, two. Okay, we've got tiles to pass. We don't have to pick a hand yet. But I am thinking probably the year hand with news, if we can get some wins. All we're missing right now is white dragons, but we can use jokers for those. We still could put potentially play like numbers with ones. Yeah, I agree, Chris. It was tough. Oh my goodness, look at, okay, we got a west and we have like numbers with sevens here. Okay, so east, east and west, one, two, we're going to keep going. We're going to keep doing the Charleston here. Let's go ahead and play the year hand. Oh no, that means I have to pass like numbers. I'm not going to pass a flower. I think passing like numbers is better than passing a flower. Because at least maybe the like numbers aren't going to hit a hand. Unless we play... Unless we play like numbers with ones. All right, we have to pass like numbers regardless. Let's keep the ones. Because I was thinking that maybe we could play a quint with no jokers. All ones with a two, three. I don't know, I don't like having a gap with no white dragons. And I really don't like passing like numbers. Look at that. Oh, that just, that just, oh my goodness, we got a flower. Oh, really? Wow, okay. I just wondered if this two was gonna come. One, two, pungs, we're gonna switch. We're going to switch to one, two pungs concealed and we have tiles we can pass. Thank you for the flower and the ones. We have tiles we can pass. We're playing one, two pungs. Last hand under consecutive run. Okay, we've got tiles to pass. No worries. Let's see. Three, good, full pass. Uh, okay. You know what I think I'm gonna do? I'm gonna pass these three because if we get wins back, we could still maybe do the news consecutive run hand. We have no jokers. It was okay, Peg. It was a pretty good Charleston, I think. Okay, we got a one back. If we get jokers, we could play a quint. Let's keep that one. We did get a north. Did I pass a east or something? Or did I? Yeah, I don't remember now. Okay, let's give up that nine dot. Okay, so we have... Lots of ones, and we have some twos. So I'm thinking the one, two, pun concealed hand. If we get jokers, I would love to play a quint tonight. I'm thinking that second from the bottom quint. There's a joker. So we're three discards away from a concealed hand. I think probably the quint is a major long shot. So probably the consecutive run. Oh, and then look what we get. A three. One, two, three. One, two, three and cracks. But we have only one joker and not enough big multiples. We don't have any big multiples. We're going to hold them, though. We don't have to make a choice yet. Eight 
one two pung yeah debbie i really like this hand too this is one of my favorite hands one two concealed pungs i think that's a really nice hand Ooh, there's a joker. Nine bamboos. Eight bamboos. Three dimes. Nine territories. Hmm. We do have some consecutive run possibility here. Uh, we'll get rid of the five. Like the um, consecutive Kong hand, we could do one, two, three, maybe. One bamboo. Oh, we're concealed. We're not taking that. That's something to keep in mind because we need three of those. Oh, look what we got. We got a one. Okay. I'm thinking we should switch to like numbers with ones. Or the quint with ones. Uh oh. We got a one. We're playing a quint. We're going to go for the quint. We're going to use these as joker bait. We're going to try to play a quint here. Here we go. Quint, baby. We don't need any of these. This, these flowers are joker bait. The only challenge here is that there's a one bam out. Right now that's a big challenge because we have only one joker. Oh, flower. Okay, I need to think about this now. We could play ones with flowers. Ones with six flowers. Let's wait and see. I would like to play a quint. Okay, I, I'm thinking we should probably, oh, I would love to play a quint, but I think we should probably play like numbers with ones and flowers. Cause I don't know, we need the one bam. Ones with flowers, Maureen, you think that we should downgrade from a quint? I only have one joker. That's why I'm thinking ones with flowers because we have only one joker. If I had more jokers, I'd go for the quint. Okay, we got to decide. Quint. Life is short. We're going to go for it. Go big. Someone going to pung it with a joker? Come on. Take it. Take it. Oh. Oh. Shoot. Nobody wanted it. But there was a hesitation. Okay, now we need jokers. <laughs> oh. Oh, shoot. Come on, take it, take it. Oh, shoot, they didn't take it. Somebody needs flowers though, I can feel it. We need jokers badly, because there's already a one bam out. I would love to get that five crack. <laughs> Chris, uh, no, you know what? I, I just can be, um, 
I, uh, I do like gambling though. I do, but, uh, I get really anxious. So I'm really not a very good gambler. And I also, uh, am, have a terrible poker face. I have so many tells when I play poker, but I do understand the game. Uh, and I do understand craps and roulette and all that. And so I do enjoy that, but I appreciate my hard earned money. So I don't like to gamble in that regard. Okay. We're good there. Okay. Um, but I do think that I, I take a lot of, um, I do risky moves playing Mahjong. I push, I, I mean, I guess you could say I'm aggressive. Oh, there's our one bam. Darn it. Now we're going to need two jokers. Shoot. Anyway, I guess you could say that I'm aggressive, but I'm not aggressive in, an, in a mean way. Like when I play in real life, I'm not mean. Um, but I, I am aggressive. I'll, I'll push a hand. I mean, it, it, this is an example of that. I, I, okay, here we go. So there's a, there are two jokers up for grabs right now. Oh, we got, okay. I'm going to get rid of this flower. Okay. How many, oh, there's three, two bams out and three, three or two, three bams are out. I was just thinking maybe we could switch to one cracks as our Kong or Quint and then do two, three and bams. Oh, that was interesting. They didn't want the Joker. Okay, we got to stay put. There's two. Oh, they got it. Okay, okay. Very nice. All right. Yeah, that was a long shot. I probably should have played like numbers with ones. Oh, well, that's what I get. Okay, here we go. Let's see if we can recover from that boo-boo. That's what I get for being greedy. Okay, we're going right into a game now. Here we go. We got to win this one. Ooh, flowers. Look at that. Very nice. Okay, we've got three flowers. What can we do with three flowers? We could do two, four, six, eight. We could do east and west with greens. We could do like numbers with twos. Okay, let's, oh, mm. these are all really good tiles. I don't know. Oh my goodness. Okay, here we go. We'll just let it go. Okay, so I'm thinking um, we need tiles to make a decision. We, we have way not enough tiles right now to make a decision. I'm thinking I just want to use those flowers. Let's see here. And we have a pair of twos. Oh, look at all these fives. Oh, we need to break that up. Okay, here we go. Okay, four flower hands or three flower hands. There's a two, four, six hand with three flowers. Like numbers with flowers. I need to tape off the quint section. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's pretty funny. Oh wow, look at this. We got fives. Like numbers with fives. Okay, we're going to pass these. We'll give up the two. Let's play like numbers with fives and flowers. Like numbers with fives and flowers. I like the like number category. Three hands in like numbers this year. Very nice. So let's see if we can get some fives. No wins have come through. I was thinking maybe we could play east and west with greens because we have three flowers. I want to use those flowers. Okay, and now look what we got. Twos. Oh, 
Okay, well, definitely we want to do the Charleston. Mm. Let's give up. Let's give up the East. We could use that green with the fives, like numbers with fives, and the green, maybe. I really don't like passing two two wins together like that, but oh well. Every pass has risk. There's not a lot you could do about that. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? Look what we got, a pair. We got a stinking pair of ones. Oh my goodness, I gotta use those. We gotta use those now. Okay, let's see here, what could we do? We could do a year hand. Two, two, zero, one, eight. Let's give up the five. Oh my gosh. Let's give up the green and keep the two because we could still use the two. We could use the fives as joker bait. Oh my goodness. How can someone pass me a pair? I don't understand that. All right. Uh, now we have a red, a red dragon. Oh, let's give up the five. Oh, all right, here we go. Maybe we could get a three dot. Okay, there's a three bam. Oh, hmm, two, three. Eh, this is not going well at all. I'm on tilt. I'm on tilt for that pair. I got a pair in Charleston. I'm going to use it. I want to use them. I want to leverage them. I'm going to leverage these. We're going to leverage those ones. Okay, we got another one. One, two, one, two. One, two, one, two pungs. I'm going to leverage those pairs. That's where the strength is. Maybe we can get three dots or we could get two cracks or we could get jokers or we could play a year hand, a year hand and mixed suits. So we don't need the wins year hand and mixed suits. Hmm. We'll see. We've got really about four discards. I got a pair of one cracks, a pair of one cracks in the Charleston. Somebody gave me a pair of one cracks in the Charleston. Okay. So here's uh, two. We could maybe play a year hand. I'm trying to see how we can use those ones. I want to use the ones. We'll see. Oh, wins. Okay. <clears throat> we got the white. We could play. I was thinking the 2018 two flowers. We need. Okay. Now we have a two, three. Joker bait. Okay. Two zero there. Let's see. Two zero one one Joker bait. Oh, this is terrible. Okay. Or we could do maybe we could do oh, use the ones as Joker bait, I guess. Because I'm not sure about this year hand potential. I think maybe one, two, three Kongs, third from the bottom under consecutive run, potentially. Or we could do one, two, one, two Pungs concealed if we get the two crack or jokers. 
There's already a two crack out though. Uh oh, oh, nope. Oh, I probably should have kept that. No, there's already two out. Two of those were out. Okay, this is going very slowly. Come on, we need a keeper. Three crack. That's not helpful. That's not helpful at all. There's one, two, bam, out. No. Okay, let's see. I don't think we have enough ones to commit to like numbers with ones. Otherwise, I might have taken that flower. But there are more flowers to come. There's only one out right now. Uh oh. Oh. Hmm. Not good. Oh my goodness, and we're not picking at all. I don't think we've picked a single keeper. This is a rough one. That's what happens when you go on tilt. It does not go well. I must be giving off bad vibes. All right, now we got, we got white dragons. Okay, 2017, two, zero, one, eight, joker bait, four flowers, 2018. There are two eight bams out right now. We have two pair of joker bait. Okay, let's see what happens. Let's give up these threes. Okay, two, zero, one, eight, and ones. 2018 with ones. There's one one dot out right now. There's two one bams out. That's a problem. So I'm thinking, let's count. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight versus, uh-oh. Oh, we don't, we, we're not ready for it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're right in between. I'm thinking the, the second and third hand down. All right, let's Kong. Okay, we're gonna commit to the second from the bottom in one suit and use the ones as joker bait. I would never have gotten those ones. Okay. So we need another joker or, or a white dragon or a two bam, of course. Yeah, this is gonna be, this is gonna be tough. We got the one. Can you believe that? That green dragon is available. Oh, what? Wait, why didn't they take their own joker? That was weird. Hmm, oh wait. Maybe that wasn't them. Maybe that was the player across from me. All right, well, anyway. 
Okay, we need two BAM White Dragon Jokers. We have one, two, three, four more picks, and I have three discards. This is going to be a long shot. I wonder if somebody wants ones. I need to get rid of these. We need to get rid of these now. There goes one. Nobody wanted it. Aw. After all that effort holding on to it, nobody even wants them. Oh, at least they're safe. Oh, that was really difficult. Okay, 369. 369 with knitted. Okay, over here. East was playing 998 pair hand. That's why they didn't want the Joker. Okay, Fran was playing a year hand. 2018 and this poor player was trying very hard for a 2018 hand to no avail all right here we go this will probably be the last hand for the session I would love to win let's see what we can do okay we got two flowers again Pair of nines, green dragon, seven, eight, nine dragons. Let's get rid of these. Let's get rid of this two. One of each suit. Here we go. Seven, eight, nine, seven, eight, nine, eight, nine, dragon, Kong, something or other. Let's see what happens. Ooh, look at what we got. Oh my goodness. What can we do with this beauty? Look at these beautiful tiles. Eight, nine, dragon. Let's pass these three. Eight, nine, dragon, maybe. Kongs. Seven, eight, nine, Kongs. No keepers. If we get three BAMs, we could play the first 369 hand. We'd have to sacrifice the eight BAMs, though. That's what I needed in the last hand, that eight BAM. Oh, I would have liked to have that year hand work out. Oh, there's an eight BAM. We'll take it. Okay, so let's get rid of the six BAM. Seven, eight, nine. Seven, eight, nine Kongs or eight, nine Dragon. These would be the third hand down under consecutive run or the third hand from the bottom under consecutive run. No keepers and we got like numbers. Like numbers. Oh. I want to keep my options open. I'm going to push them through. Let's hope, Maureen. I would love I would love to win. I like to win, I must say. It's encouraging to win. No keepers. But we have good tiles to pass. That's a good pass. No keepers. We're on optional cross already. Here we go. I would like to get a seven bam or a green dragon, please. wrong color okay here we go we're off Eight 
So we need either seven bam or green dragon to solidify. We don't know which one yet, but we're playing consecutive run. One One green dragons would be nice. I like that hand. I think that's a pretty hand. Oh, Joker bait. It's always nice to have a little joker bait because it does work sometimes. It's kind of hit or miss, as you'll find out. I have some videos coming out on Sunday. Skill builders. Um, Maureen asks, do you play with the sound muted on the game always? No. I have it on, but it's low. You probably can't hear it um, because some people have said that, can you not hear my computer? Because people can't hear me if my sound is too high. But when I play, I, I have the sound up. I do like to hear the sound. My husband thinks it's funny when the game calls out the flowers. Chrysanthemum, orchid, bamboo, plum. Is that what they are? We're going to Kong. Okay, yes, but you were wondering if it is easier without the voice. Oh, I don't know. I think it just depends, I guess, on, it's kind of just a preference thing. It, I could do with or without it. It, it doesn't hurt or help. It's really more exper ex experiential. You know, when you play with other people in America, we say the name of the tile as a courtesy. And so we're used to that. So I think that... People are just used to hearing the tiles called out. I hope that helps answer the question. Okay, we're holding on to this joker bait. We're going to hold on to it till right about, right about here, right above my name, and then we'll start getting rid of it if we haven't already. Okay, we need tiles. There are no green dragons out yet. There are no seven bams out yet. When you, you call a crack a character. Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh, I doubt anyone's going to want that. All three. Ah, oh, darn. Nobody wants some. Uh-oh, there goes the green. Oh, that's too bad. I was hoping for the green, but that's okay. We can use the sevens maybe. We need jokers. Jokers and sevens. Oh, these last few hands, I have not picked well. It's been rough. Oh, shoot. One bamboo. Eight characters. White dragon. We need keepers. Oh, my goodness. I haven't had a keeper. Oh, Joker, finally, goodness. We need another one now, or a seven. There are no sevens out. Green dragon. There goes the other green. At least it's safe. Five Maybe. 
Someone could need it for repair, I suppose. In which case, we should probably get rid of it. Maybe someone's holding the sevens. Three bamboo. That five bam is available. Plum. No. Marzal. Oh, darn it. Oh, bummer. Okay. Very nice. Ouch. Okay. So let's see. Fran was playing 369. 369 pair hand, maybe. Let's see. I think they were trying for the 369 pair hand. They had a joker to get rid of. Okay, then here. Also, let's see. Three, six, five, six, seven Kongs. They were playing the same hand as me, and they had my seven bam. Yeah, we were fighting each other on that one. Okay. Let's see here. Maybe, uh, Judy, thank you for coming to the live stream. We have about 15 minutes. Maybe we could go ahead and try to play another game. Stick around if you'd like. We'll try to play another game. One more game. If we can get into a game. Oh, good. We're going to get right into it. One more game. All right. Let's see if we could end on a high note. I'm not going to be greedy this time and try to play a quint with no jokers. Oh, look it. There's a joker. Okay, here we go. No multiples. <laughs> You're going to stick around? <laughs> Please do. Okay, here we go. Oh, shoot. Okay, I'm going to hold that dragon. Okay, we have all three eights. We have nines. We have fives and sixes. Let's get rid of the four, the five. And we have to pick something else. The six. No. Yes, because I don't want to send off like numbers. Okay, we can get rid of this five and this five. We'll play nines and eights. Okay, we got our first multiple. So let's go ahead and get rid of these little numbers. Okay, Chris, thank you so, uh, let's see, yeah, thank you so much for coming by. It's always a pleasure to have you. Okay, so we're going to play eights and nines, maybe like numbers with eights. Or eight, nine consecutive run. Here's a seven and a nine. Seven, nine. We have tiles we can pass. Let's go ahead and give up on this red, I think. So we have eight, nine, eight, nine. I'm thinking at this point, maybe the eight, nine pung hand concealed. Or we could play a quint with eights. Do you think? We got an eight. There's an eight. Let's get rid of the three and the west. Okay, eight, nine, eight, nine, seven, eight, nine. West and three is going away. Eight, nine, eight, nine. Oh, eight, nine, eight, nine. Hmm. Eight, nine, pungs. Eights with like numbers. Let's give up the nine because we could play eight, eights, like numbers category, or if we get more eights, we could play quint, the quint, the consecutive run quint, second from the bottom. That would be a nice way to close out the night. Right here. Eights, seven, eight, nine. Let's see what happens. Didn't I just say a minute ago that I shouldn't get greedy? Oh my gosh, we got fives. What in the world? Insanity. Second from, oh, I have a joker. If I have a joker, I would rather use the joker and play a quint than I would to give up a joker and play a, a pair hand. Look what we got, eights. We're going for a quint. We are, we're going for it. Seven, eight, nine, quint. Three tiles to pass. 
I'm going to go ahead and pass flower because we're playing a quint. <laughs> you're, you're scared to death of that hand. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, we're going to pass a flower. This is one of those rare occasions when I will pass a flower because look at all we need is a joker and we'll be set for a quint. Oh, shoot. Ah, uh, it didn't pay off. Okay, that's all right. All we need is a joker. And we'll be set. We can quint one of these eights. Okay, we have three discards. Three discards for a quint. We just need eights. Eights and a joker. Eights and a joker. Eights and a joker. No twos. We don't need a two. We need eights and a joker. We need eights. Eights and a joker. Come on. Okay, we have joker bait. Joker bait with the two. Let's see if we can maybe nab a joker with the two. We have a long way to go, though, before the third Four wall. Four dots. Eight wins. If an eight goes down, I'll take it with our only joker. Four dots. Quint. Quint. Okay, we got Joker bait. Nine dots. Red dragon. Kong. Oh, they're all there. Nine characters. Green dragon. Okay, I was a little concerned about that dragon. Green dragon. We need a joker. Seven characters. One character. Um, what? One Hi, Karen. Six, eight, bam. Six. Nine characters. Ooh, ooh. White dragon. I don't have seven dots. I have eight Seven dots, bamboos. a quint of eight dots. Four bamboos. Nine bamboos. Five bamboos. South wind. East wind. We need a joker. Oh, we got the eight. Look at that. All we need is an eight bam and a joker. Oh, this would be really encouraging to win this hand. We got the eight crack. One dot. One character. South wind. Three dots. We really, really need that joker. Can't do much without that joker. Nobody wanted the two. two. There's a six spam out. West wind. A lot of times you can count on picking at least two jokers from the wall. Three bamboos. We got the eight bam. Six bam All we need to do is pick a joker now. One little itty bitty joker. That's all we need. One itty bitty joker. Three bamboos. I would love to pick it. East wind. Nine dots. Seven, eight, nine. Quint. West wind. We need that joker. Four dots. 
Come on, Joker. North wind. Oh, seven. Seven characters. Six bamboos. It would help if somebody had an exposure with Jokers. That's when you can have pickings. Come on, Joker. Two bamboos. We need exposures with Jokers. That is a hindrance right now. If you're playing a Quint, if you have Jokers and exposures, it can really help. Pass. Oh, shoot. Oh. Eight bamboos. Pass. Seven bamboos. We need to pick a joker. Come on. Bamboos. Ah, oh, darn it. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more picks. Green, Green, dragon. Green dragon. Oh, shoot. Four dots. These concealed hands are crippling me. Seven dots. North wind. Oh, darn. One character. One dot. Okay, jokers, jokers in the wall. East wind. Ah, darn it. Five bamboos. Five bamboos. Two dots. Come on, joker. Joker, joker. Kong. Oh, there's a joker. No, they're all out. Four oh, it's out. Two bamboos. Joker in the wall, maybe. Ooh, nope. Those are all out, too. Those are all out. Four bamboos. Ah, shoot. Three dots. Five percent chance. Seven characters. Ugh, darn it. Five. Three jokers are out. Got it. We got it. That's how you end the night. Quit. <laughs> oh my goodness. What were the chances of that happening? Oh, two jokers, one in the start and one in the wall. Oh, I was sweating bullets on that. But that was a good, a good way to end the night, I think. I hope you all enjoyed this live stream session. If you haven't played at Mahjong Time yet and you want to give it a try, send me an email so that I can send you a VIP code and you can come and check it out. It really is a great place to play. It's a wonderful community and the support team at Mahjong Time is fabulous. So I hope everybody had a really good time. That, that really was the highlight of the night, I think, besides, of course, all the participation in the chat and in the community here. Thanks everybody for coming to the live stream. It's so good to have you here. I, it really encourages me when you come and hang out with me for a little while. And I hope more and more people, thank you. I hope more and more people come to the live streams and we can build this community. I think as we grow, maybe we could even do some special sessions and maybe even do some kind of marathon fundraising marathon. I, that's kind of a dream of mine to do a fundraising marathon online at Mahjong Time. I have to research it, but I think that would be a really fun time. So listen, thank you everybody for coming. I really, really appreciate the camaraderie and I'm seeing a lot of the same people in the room and I just really, really appreciate it so much. And thank you so much um, for that chat. I think it was Cheryl uh, Cheryl, let me see here. Debbie, 
Debbie Kearney, thank you for the super chat. I really do appreciate the support. Um, it, it just gives me so much encouragement. And there are many others who support my channel financially, and I truly appreciate it. And of course, all the likes, the comments, sharing about the channel, all those things help my channel so much and help spread the word about Mahjong. One of the reasons I like to do what I do is because I want to spread awareness of this great game as we all love it so much. I want more and more people to play. So thank you very, very much for coming. I hope you enjoyed it. And next week, oh, thank you. <laughs> Let's see, I'm not going to be greedy and then I do a quint. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. Um, next week, I will be traveling, so there will be no live stream. The next live stream will be on the Sunday after that for Richi Mahjong. So, uh, oh no, that's not right. Let me see here. The third Sunday is Siamese Mahjong on the 18th. We're going to try to do a live stream for Siamese Mahjong on the 18th. I don't know if y'all play Siamese Mahjong, but it should be, it should be out right now. Let's go check it out. Let's go see. Let's see if it's out. I haven't checked. I thought it was supposed to be released in November. Nope, not yet. It hasn't been released yet. I'm hoping that we'll be able to play Siamese Mahjong later this month. I thought I heard somewhere that it was going to be out in November. So we'll have to wait and see. I hope you all are excited for that, though. All right. Well, I'm going to have that uh, be the conclusion of our live stream. Thank you again, everybody. Wait, you're getting married on the 18th. Oh, Marcia, congratulations. That's very exciting. We'll have a wonderful day and a blessed relationship going forward. That is really fabulous. It's nice to have a companion, I think. All right. Well, good night, everybody. And I guess I'll do my traditional sign off. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, click subscribe. After you click subscribe, click that little gray bell so you get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next live stream, may all your picks be keepers. <laughs>